Well, uh, thank you very much for having me here today. And we should uh, also thank Rick Knapp, who's in his 50th year. He's run this parade for a number of years. How about a round of applause for Rick? It's always great to be back here in Bennington for the Bennington Battle Day Parade. I've made it down here for the last several years, and it's always an event I look forward to. Many of you probably already know this, but Bennington Battle Day is Vermont's only state holiday. And it's a holiday worth celebrating because it makes a, makes a turning point in our nation's history. Nearly 250 years ago, Lieutenant Colonel uh, Friedrich Bomb of the British Army commanded 700 royal troops to raid Bennington for food, munitions, and other supplies. Little did they know that we had 2,000 militiamen under the command of General John Stark that were stationed here. And during the battle, General Stark's troops were reinforced by Colonel Seth Warner, as well as by Ethan Allen's Green Mountain Boys. Despite the British forces being better equipped, our Green Mountain Boys a decisive victory and helped turn the course of the war. It's important for us to remember this event in American history because it helped shape our nation. But today I also want to really uh, take the opportunity to recognize those two local heroes that we've learned so much about today, Charlie Becker, the Grand Marshal of today's parade, and Alex Mayer, who uh, the parade is dedicated to. Charlie, for your years of service, you've made a lasting mark. Your service in the U.S. Armed Forces in 67 years on the Shaftesbury Fire Department has left our nation, our state, a much safer place. And while you're working for your, your community, I, uh, I had the opportunity to meet uh, Charlie a few years ago up in St. Albans at a fire association event, and uh, he told me one thing that many probably here don't know, but Charlie can ride a bicycle backwards. So, said he still does, so I asked WCX if they could come down and, and treat him as a super senior, and uh, he did just that and rode his bicycle in his 90s backwards, something that I ride my bike on a daily basis, and I'm sure I can't do that. So uh, please uh, let join me in thanking Charlie for his years of service. Alex, you've dedicated your life to uh, Bennington County. Uh, for three generations, your family has comforted others during very, very difficult times. And you've been an active community member in the Eagles, the Elks, the Moose, the Knights of Columbus. And you've put so many hours into this community, and so many hours of community service. We're so very fortunate. And the $200,000 for uh, the uh, Bennington Area Hospice uh, Tournament for the Bennington Hospice Center is truly remarkable. So please, again, let's uh, let's thank uh, Alex for his great work. <laughs> and with that, I'm going to give two letters of commendation to Mary Morrissey, who will be in her great hands. Thank you very much, Mary, for all your good work. And uh, she'll get you those letters framed. Thank you again. And let's, uh, enough speaking, let's get this parade back in order. Thank you very much. Governor Phil Scott.